Ooh, that's hot. Whew. Oh, hey there. Mike here from Hosting and Server Pros. Dot com and today I'm here to review Bluehost and HostGator, possibly the two most commonly compared hosting companies. And you know that is because they're neck and neck. I mean, they're both very high quality, uh, mid-level hosting companies. Just to give you an idea, you know, if if you're gonna have a site that's gonna have between ten and a hundred thousand hits, then they're gonna be good companies to go with. Um, if you want to get if you have like a professional site with millions of hits per month that is running applications, then you're going to want to move up to something like Rackspace. Uh, that's going to be a lot more expensive, but it's just going to be have that extra space to get you everything you need. So on to the review, HostGator and Bluehost. Um, they've both been around for over 10 years. HostGator was founded in a college dorm room in 2002. Kind of cool. Bluehost has been around since the 90s, back even when hosting just kind of came around in the, in the mid-90s. Um, and honestly, they both have very similar features. And I've used both companies. They have great customer service, uh, either one. HostGator, I think, wins the mascot, got to say. Um, but in the end, I think Bluehost is better. And I'll tell you why. Because... If you look at HostGator's plans, so they have three different plans, all right? You're going to have the, the Hatchling plan for uh, $3.96 a month, and you can only have one domain on that plan, just one. Uh, it's, you know, it's all right if you want to have just one website, but I think a lot of people that are starting to host are going to have more than one website. And to do that with HostGator, you're going to have to bump yourself up to the $6.39 per month. And that's a little bit more expensive than Bluehost's uh, $4.95 per month plan. And something else that's cool about Bluehost is that, so say you sign up for that $4.95 per month plan, you're actually going to be able to just cancel at any time and get all of your money back. So they have an anytime money back guarantee. And that's what sets them apart, I think, from HostGator. Just that extra money. I mean, you're going to save about $10 to $15 extra dollars a year which, you know, it's money in your pocket. So that's it. That's a HostGator um, versus Bluehost review. And uh, so that's it. That's the Bluehost versus HostGator review. Um, try to keep it short and sweet. If you have any questions, you can uh, email me or just check out the website at hostingandserverpros.com. And until that, next time.